The next NASA mission to Mars is going to have an extremely exciting uh, technology demonstration mission, which entails flying for the first time a craft on uh, another body in the solar system. The small helicopter is uh, named uh, Ingenuity, and the idea is to prove that actually we can safely and efficiently fly uh, craft on uh, other planets. If the technology demonstration is successful, future missions might uh, heavily use uh, uh, aerial vehicles to assist, for example, rovers, providing information about uh, areas that are uh, difficult to reach, or maybe to carry payloads between one asset and another an asset on the surface. But the first step is, of course, to prove that this technology is viable. The Mars atmosphere is ratified, which means that getting lift that allows a flying machine to fly is much harder. But there are other challenges, like, for example, the temperature on Mars can be extremely frigid. It can reach all the way to minus uh, 80, minus 100 uh, degrees Celsius. Mars, though, has some redeeming uh, features. For example, on Mars, gravity is lower than the gravity we have on Earth, so that helps to some extent. The end result is a helicopter that is uh, rather light, with blades that uh, are quite large, about uh, a meter, and that spin much faster than a typical helicopter you would have on uh, Earth. I had the opportunity to give contribution, albeit quite small, to this mission. I was pr particularly working on the problem of landing site selection, how to pick the best area on Mars where to land as a trade-off between scientific interest and safety for the landing procedure. This is an extremely important mission for NASA. Perseverance is going to be a mission whose primary goal is to uh, search for biosignatures on Mars, basically to search explicitly for life on Mars. This is extremely fascinating if actually other forms of, uh, or at least biosignatures are found on Mars, might change the way we perceive ourselves as humans. <laughs>